Businesses and people living along the Arbutus Corridor in Vancouver to remove any and all property along the train tracks by the end of the month. For more on why, let's go to Greg Harper. He is live in Vancouver with the details this morning. Greg. Good morning, Kyle. I'm standing in uh, uh, clearly a community that has been built here over the years. We have a community garden uh, to the right of me. This is Pine Street Community Garden. You can see people have set up uh, some chairs. This is an area that people walk their dogs, they ride their bikes. Uh, but this is land that CP Rail does own, and the railway company uh, has been reviewing the line here since uh, April, looking into the possibility of reactivating it. The tracks run from Marine Drive to Granville Island. No decisions have been made yet as engineers continue to look at to what kind of shape the tracks are in. The reason people and businesses have been told to remove their property by July 31st uh, is so, according to CP, that uh, their employees uh, need complete access to the entire corridor to do a thorough examination. The last time trains were used on this track, 13 years ago, uh, back in 2001, I did talk to a spokesperson with CP Rail this morning. He says traditionally uh, they have access to 50 feet on either side of the track, so potentially uh, lots of property will have to be moved, including this community garden. Kyle?